Hello back and we are continuing in making our crawlish. So far I have shown you and I think you did your little house which is this part of the crawlish. And now we will be moving on to this part and this part, okay? Until the next little house, see? So this, we will be making this and this. Um, before we head on, there is something you need to do. On each thread that is coming out of your little house, please put on one white bead and then stop it. So one extra white bead and stop it. When you do this, then we move on to making this part of our crouch. As you can see, it's made out of um, kind of bow-like lines and little circles like this one, kind of little circles that, that are hanging down from those lines. Now I have a cheat sheet for you so you can know exactly which is the what is the number of beads needed to make this so i will show it to you now because that's basically the only thing you need to know you have to you have to um kind of check this out and if possible you should um if possible you should uh copy it or just uh, when you make your curls just stop at this end rewind it and uh, remember what to do because this is all you need to know to make the next part of cows. This would be the house that we just made. These little spots here are the white beads that I just asked you to put on and stop. And from here on, we move into adding the beads on our thread. And the green, the green numbers are the numbers of the beads you need to put on the thread. So when we start here, right next to our pearl, this is our pearl. So the first thread right from the pearl, you need to add on four beads. When you add on four beads, then you'll make this circle. I will show you how. And after this circle, you need to add on four more plus one. Now this plus one is just so you can even the sides because you put on one white bead before and you have to even it up, even the number up. So you have to put one white bead extra. So this would actually be five beads. But just make sure that you put on one extra and you stop it here also. Okay. Now as far as those little circles go, this is the only thing you need to know. You have to put on seven beads, then a pearl, then five beads, and then stop it the way that I will show you, okay? So the little circles are easy. It's seven, pearl, five, and stop it, okay? So let's, let's try this. I will be starting from the first thread on the right from my pearl because that's what I was just showing you, okay? I need to put on four beads. See, this is it, four beads. And this is all, the right side is all in white because we are making a traditional creation couch. Now when you, when you learn this, you can choose any color of color, but, but I'm just showing you traditional one. So we need four white beads. We'll just let them sit here and wait because the next thing we need to do, see, after we added on four beads, is our circle. So let's re review. It's seven beads, pearl, five beads. I'll just go ahead and put this on and I won't slide them down. I'll just leave them close to my hand, okay? So it's seven white beads. That's two, three, four, five, six, seven white beads. I kind of slide them a little bit, but keep them close to my hand over here. See, then I will add a pearl. 
I'm adding a pearl. Oops. Okay, so now I have seven beads and a pearl. And now I need five more white beads. So I'll count, I'll count. that's one, two, three, four, five, five white beads. Now that I have my combination, which is made out of seven white beads, one pearl and five beads, I will slide them down, but not all the way, just a little bit before we come to an end. So like this, and I will hold them in my left hand like this. And this is the end of the same thread. This is the same thread. What I need to do now is kind of separate the first two that I put on and go through them with the end of this same thread. I have to go through all the way, all the way. See? And what this does and what I have now is exactly what I wanted, my little circle, okay, with the pearl hanging down, down here, okay, this is what I need, this is what I wanted, and now from here on, let me check my cheat sheet, I need four white beads plus one, that's all together, five beads, and the last one I will stop, okay, see, now let me go ahead and do this, so that's five beads all together. That's one. That's two, three, four, five beads. I'll just slide them down all the way to my circle. And the last bead, which is the fifth one, that was my plus one, I'll stop this one the same way you've, you've stopped the beads before. Okay, when I do this, this is all I need to do because from here on, I will be making another little house. Okay, this is all I need so far. So just follow my little sheet, cheat sheet that I've shown you before and keep doing this all the way till you come to the last thread on the right and now when you look at the ones on the left, you just follow this. Uh, the only thing that uh, you can you can um, choose is the color. You can do all of this in white. That's just fine and it's really nice. But a uh, traditional one has a combination. I will just show you quickly. So these little circles are made uh, again in the colors of the Croatian national flag that's red, white and blue and then pearl and on the other side red, white and blue and then pearl. Uh, if you want to make the, these exact ones then you should when you come to the circle you should put on four white ones red, white, blue, pearl then reverse blue, white, red and two white ones okay and then you slide through the first two that you put on so this is four white colors beat colors two white okay and that's how you will finish this part this part is actually called schlinga okay another creation word schlinga try saying this schlinga <laughs> have fun so you can you can learn another word while you do this just follow my sheet sheet that I have shown you before.